everyone and welcome back to my channel. So today's video is a bit of a haul. I went to Pound World, I went to Home Bargains, Pep and Co and to Shoe Zone. Now most of these places actually do have sales on at the moment and Pound World is closing down. So they had 40% off, 50% off and 70% off their lines. So yeah, I thought I'd show you what I bought. So if we start with Pound World, the first item I got was this blue um, Paw Patrol colouring set. In it you get two sticker sheets, ten paint cakes, eight crayons, eight colouring pencils, eight markers, two sticker sheets, a ruler, a HB pencil, sharpener, eraser, sponge, mixing palette and a paintbrush. This should have been £5 and it was 40% off so that makes it just under £4. So I thought for that, that was a really good price and it's going to keep the kids entertained probably in the summer holidays. So yeah, I thought that was worth a couple of quid. And a, another item from Pound World is this Tattoo Studio Kit. This again was 40% off, originally it was £5, so it would have made it roughly £3.80, £4, something like that. So in here you get everything that you need to make um, tattoos. So you get like the stencils, the glitter, the little um, diamante things, little brushes here. And yeah, I think the kids are going to enjoy doing that over the summer holidays. So I thought for four quid, that was an absolute bargain. So yeah, really good. I just picked up these little blocks for Ellie, these alphabet blocks. These were three pound and they had 40% off as well. So they were two pound roughly. And yeah, it's just, um, just some blocks just for her to play with so hopefully she'll enjoy them and then I got two Crayola colouring books to go with the new felt tip pens and crayons these were a pound each reduced down to 50p and the Crayola ones are pretty good they're not like it's not like that crappy cheap paper it's actually really good paper so for 50p I thought that was absolutely bargain so I picked up two of those I do use the Dr Brown's bottles and I have tried with Ellie with a different bottle before, she just won't have it. But this Disney bottle which has got like Minnie Mouse on and it's got these two little handles at the side was a pound reduced to 50p so I thought I'd just try it just to put some water in just to get her used to obviously coming off the Dr Brown's bottles. So yeah we'll see how she gets on with that. And then I got some beakers this is a troll one and that is a despicable me one they're quite tall they should have been a pound and they were reduced to 50p each so obviously if you've got kids you're always needing beakers so i thought they were pretty cute and then i smashed a bowl the other day so we needed a couple more bowls so i picked up these troll bowls these are plastic they should have been a pound and they were 50p each so i thought they was really good for cereal and snacks and stuff they also had batteries half price and I picked up some AAA batteries for Ellie's My Hummy. These were a pound reduced to 50p. I picked up Amy some Dory socks. There's two packs, two pairs in there and they were a pound I think, reduced from two pound maybe. But yeah, they're quite cute. And then I picked up some more socks, a white pair, a grey pair and a black pair. Again, they were a pound. I picked up these two razors. These were half price, so they were 50p. And yeah, I needed some new razors, so I thought I'd give those a go. And then finally, from Pound World, I bought these two really large tumblers. These were 30p, can you believe it? And they are actually for Halloween because they've got like schools on. I don't know if you can see. But it's not really that not noticeable. I'll get my words out. So yeah, 30p each. I thought they were really, really good. And they're really tall. Perfect for the kids to have water in and stuff. So yeah, that's everything from a pound world. Next up, I'll just show you these trainers I got for Ellie. Not Ellie. Um, Amy from Shoe Zone. They're just like black ones with some pink detail in the inside they're black laces with white soles at the bottom white soles at the bottom 
and they were £10 reduced to 4 99 so I thought with the summer holidays coming up then they would just they would do just to throw on to go to the park or whatever so it doesn't matter if she gets a mucky and stuff because they was only cheap um, and then what did I get from Pepper & Co I picked up myself a pair of just grey shorts these were £2 I think or were they £3 sorry they were £3 but yeah just a bog standard pair of shorts really I got Amy some um, pyjama shorts and a top me to you ones with some blue shorts and then that really cute top they were five pound reduced to three pound so i got her those then i got sophie the same in paw patrol i hope she doesn't think they're too babyish but they're the only ones that were big enough to fit her and they were five pound reduced to three pound because they haven't got many pajamas that have shorts in so they'll be ideal I got Ellie this cute little top, it says cool beyond my years and this was £1.50. I got Ellie a baby grow sleep suit thing, this was £2.50 and it says no one sleeps unless I do which is really appropriate because she had me up three times during the night last night. So yeah, just a bog standard baby grow. Then I just picked up myself some pyjamas. Don't really wear these sort of this sort of thing, but I thought I'd try it. It's just a top like that with some nice detail just there, and then the back is like that. And then you just get some black shorts. And they were four pounds, so I thought I'd give them a go, especially with the hot weather. Okay, and lastly, we're going to go on to home bargains. First of all, I got a four-pack of toilet roll. These were £1.9p. Um, I have used these before. They're pretty good, so just picked up some of those. I picked up some quavers. They were a pound for a six-pack, and Ellie's already had a pack. Some milk. And I picked up some disposable bibs, they're just handy for nursery and when we're out and about and I think they were around 79p and there's 12 in there so yeah they'll be quite handy. I picked up a couple of mugs. The first one is like a minty colour and it says do not worry and be happy and then there's a donut on there. And then the next one is a white one that says sprinkled with love and I think they were £1.29 each something like that I picked up this 1001 carpet fresh I picked up the Thai orchid and passion fruit quick drying fine foam no need to vacuum and this was £1.79 and I've seen this on a lot of cleaning videos on Instagram stories so I thought I'd pick that up and see what it's like. I picked up some more socks. Can you tell I'm obsessed with buying the kids socks? Two pack and they were just over a pound I believe. There's six of these sponges in here and these are going to be perfect for the sink and stuff. If, they, if you can just see they're like thick sponges. So they're really good for cleaning and I'm not quite sure how much they were. Around a pound I think. I picked up some bicarbonate of soda, this is for my plug holes, if you pop some of this in and then add some boiling water then hopefully it should give your plug hole a good clean and yeah I saw that on Instagram stories as well. And of course I picked up some more Zaflora, this is the pink grapefruit, this is my favourite at the minute so every time I see some I do just pick some up and that was 99p. I picked up some grapes. I picked up this sweet potato and chicken hip organic thing for Ellie, this was 69p. I then picked up um, a few teacher cards, teacher leaving cards, not teacher leaving cards, thank you cards. These were from the card factory and they're really cute. So we've got that one, that one, that one and that one and they were 59p each 
So they're for the kids to write a thank you little card to the teachers. I picked up loads of these cat food things. And the last item is some little bows for Ellie's hair. Two in there for 69p. So yeah, I hope you've enjoyed this haul. Let me know what your favourite items are. And if you've been to Home Bargains or Poundland or anything recently, let me know in the comments down below and I'll head on over to your channel and have a look. But yeah, don't forget to hit that like button. Give me a subscribe if you haven't already. And I'll see you in my next one. Bye bye.